it's a shame that the uh the the smite game we did yesterday uh the quality of the audio went everywhere uh so it won't be able to be uploaded on the uh, full channel and will eventually be erased of time considering that was our like first victory in 17 games or something uh <laughs> sounds right yeah uh but yeah. it wasn't it- it wasn't a clean victory by any means. It was a clean victory. Those people were trying to win. <laughs> 13 to 33, but we won. And that teaches you to play the objective. I always play the objective. No, I know, but they were just going for kills. Mm hmm. You should be playing arena for that. Um, <laughs> okay. So arena players trying to transition to conquest. Oh, you can copy a seed now. That's nice. Oh, and there are you? Yeah. That's nice. That way we can actually ask online, like, what's a good seat to actually start? Because fuck this one. So I actually went back to, uh... God damn it. I don't think I'm... I think my Steam's all wacky. Give me a second. Yeah, it's not online. Oh, Steam's not online? Yeah. No, no, it's not. As in, like, Steam itself. I mean, I do not see you online. Oh, okay, then you, you see other people online, though, right? Yes. You, give me a second, Steam's just being finicky. I thought you were just saying Steam itself was offline. We're fucked. Hasn't gone to that point yet. Hope it won't. One day. So I, I got on um, and checked. Uh, I did a bit of work on the elevator, which was barely any work at all, really. But uh, I... I checked to see where the um, rest of the like the other side of the world was like, and there's mm -hmm. just there's jungle up there that's blocking the corruption from spreading. Nice. Let's see, sure it's a shame you can't. Uh, it's a shame uh, like two people cannot share like uh, the ownership of a world. I mean. Technically, they can, but that's a whole other problem. Okay. Like there are there are ways to do that. Uh, like there are Starbound servers that are open at all times. You know what I mean? Yeah, but if I remember correctly, that's you actually have to pay money for those. You don't need to pay money, but the people that make it easy for you make you pay money. It's like how um, Steven has a Minecraft Realms. Yeah. Oh. Wait, are you on base? I mean, are you online? There you are. Um, there you go. Now you can find out where I am. Blue team. I did not get more wood. <laughs> oh, the merchant arrived. I think he showed up while I was checking to see where the, uh... What the other side was like of the world. Uh... I, uh, well, he has a mini shark, wind block, and musket balls. I'm shocked that that's... Never mind, I don't know why I'm trying to fight it. <laughs> I hate that that table's there. What, the switch table? Oh, that table. table. Yeah. Yeah. Ah, <laughs> oh, damn it! 
Joe, you saw oh, me. I... You saw me mining on this side. What did you think I was doing that for? Son of a bitch! I keep falling out the same hole. Our our grandiose elevator plans are not good. <laughs> I mean, no, because that means we'll have to destroy the, the mine part system. I mean, that's that's just that's just gonna have to be. We can technically uh, leave the minecart system in place. And risk the corruption. We just have to clear like a chunk of the surrounding area out from existence. I'm trying to kill the mother slime, but it's hard with a yo-yo. I also checked out our uh, last world we were on, and I looked at how far we've come uh, on that world. That world looks so beautiful, looking back on it. It's, it's, yeah. am it's amazing. Like, I'm, I'm actually kind of, like, looking forward to how the game's... We sh you should get wood while you're up there. You okay, I'm I mean, I'm just... I'm just sad I don't get don't have my characters from back then. Yeah, that was the other thing. You know my um my giant treasure ship I made? Yeah. Uh that doesn't exist anymore. Yeah. That entire world is gone. <laughs> but I think it was yeah. probably because we were using mods on that world and when the update came around it just uh you know looped it away. Which, hey, you know, we stopped playing that mod anyways. So. Maybe it's because I had the mod only item that deleted my character. Just deletes your character. How dare you play a game? I was gonna ask you something, but I'm having the hardest time recalling what it was supposed to be. What? <laughs> Sorry, I'm just watching you use that yo-yo all wrong. Um, that's what I'm trying to recall. <laughs> I mean, don't try and do it. Well, I suppose there's always the question as to what uh, your plans are. While I try to recall uh... my actual conversation pieces. Yeah, I'm like, I mean, for life, for today, or just in the game? <laughs> yeah, why not? It's <laughs> it's a mixed bag here. <laughs> for life, unfortunately, none. Oh. <laughs> is it because of the quarantine? Uh, oh, yeah, that's what you know. I just want to finish college. Mm. Um, there, um, other than that, I really just, uh... Today, I'm probably going to play a bit with you now, then do some chores and play smite with uh, my other friend. Fair enough. I think part of the thing is, I'm trying to recall what the thing is that I was wanting to uh, say. But what I'm constantly thinking about, because I saw uh, in some manga that they were doing like the, the I Love You game. And they explained what it was, but like it wasn't just some Japanese like thing they were doing. I remember distinctly my church, um, you know, like, in catechism class, uh, like, my, like, I don't know, I feel like 30 kids, like, 16-year-olds, all, like, did this, like, circled around and tried to do the, uh, oh, a lemon, that's cute. Uh, it was something where the game was, uh, went, like, you're supposed to go, like, exp say I love you to someone, and if they react in any way that isn't, like, you know, like, if they're embarrassed or whatever, you know, they lose and then they have to do it to someone. And then, <laughs> I'm just thinking about, like, what a cruel game to play when people don't like you. Because, <laughs> you know, the, the two girls that I was friends with would just, you know, they did it to me, so I crack a smile. And then, you know, I can't do it to them, and, like, I tried, but, like, they'll just sit there like, eh? <laughs> And I don't know, I don't know anyone else. Like, if I do it to them, they act like they're disgusted.
Ah. Uh, <laughs> you were supposed to protect our flank. Yeah. I can't do both. <laughs> You're, we're either getting killed by zombies or the yeah. ass. We need to get a summoning thing to protect us sooner. But yeah, I, I had to like. Re what was worse was I had to read that chapter like seven times because I just kept absentmindedly flipping through the, the pages while looking at the pictures. Not reading it because I was constantly thinking about like, wow, kids are cruel. <laughs> yeah. Well, I'm. Well, this is the thing. I almost stopped listening entirely to you because when you started saying the name of the class. With Cataclysm? You, you said. Yeah, you said Cataclysm, and I'm like, that's not the name of the class. It's a uh, Catechism. Yeah, I know. Yes, we have. We have uh, the name is very similar in Portugal. Well, it's about to become a graveyard. Yeah. It felt like a cataclysm. Ugh. <laughs> <laughs> How will I spawn? This is bad. Ah! Break some things while you're up there. <laughs> I cannot. Play. I'm constantly seeing stars that aren't hitting enemies. They're just so close to, like, giving them. Goodbye, Joe. I hate this. It's now a graveyard. <laughs> yeah, I know. I'll try to fix that. Watching you. Oh, you fixed it. But for how long? I don't know. You could help me the last time. I am helping you. I'm killing the zombos. I hate that that's true. So, yeah, let me see. No, why? Every time I kill an eye, why is there another one? Man, I'm trying to, uh... Oh, wait, there's a Grayson right here I can get rid of. Um... So I was just looking at things, because I'm trying to remember what my, uh, question I was going to posit to you, but, man, you know, you start up something, you just completely forget. Please, 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 that hole. No! Fuck you, dude. I'm really focusing on things. I asked, please, please, please dig that hole, and you just let me die. Get in here. Great, now I'm gonna die. Like, I actually cannot. I know, I think since they're all in the hole, you can escape now. See, they can't get out anymore. Oh, never mind. <laughs> the, the problem is every time you manage to, to get some, some just appear at my back and kill me. Like that, I see. Get on in here, friend. I hate this. Oh, 
Why is she directly where I spawn? Okay, that's better. Let me just... Run, 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 run. Oh no, that's a ghost. Yeah, I could look at that. <laughs> Oh, fuck. <laughs> oh! Ravens attack you, huh? <laughs> the problem is they're making me back- I'm- I have two ghosts on me, David, and I, they're making me back up two- uh, you know, You'll eventually hit the elevator and you'll be safe. I mean, safe from this mortal coil, yeah. Let's see. Demon Eye. Alright, let me go back to helping you. Um. Uh, I mean, no, now they're away from the entrance. I can finally enter. Please tell me I can enter. Yes. Uh. Block. I've locked the entrance. You should really set the bed down here as your spawn. Yeah. Should I put the pool in? I'm gonna get more wood. I really don't have enough. I have 322. Which is not enough but to start. Yeah. I don't, and I don't want to be up there. I've lost like a gold since I got into server. Day. That just should show you, since we're dying constantly, how fast you make money. But anyway. Yeah, I'm sure that's what's showing us. Let's see. I'm really I trying. Forgot. Yeah. Well, since I can't remember what I was going to say, what were you? What uh, things have you been up to lately, Joe? I mean, since last time, not much. I haven't even played the uh, Kingmaker again. You haven't got like say. No, I suppose you wouldn't have been have had time to do anything new at your job because you're just quarantined. What a, yeah. a what a fascinating time for life. Yeah, I mean, yesterday I played the what's that uh, game? Uh, I always forget. Uh, it's the uh, yeah Game of Thrones board game. Uh, there's some fascinating shit happening up here, Joe. Like what? Like the monsters when I hit them, they get knocked back through walls and then they despawn. That's great. I, you know, sometimes it's uh. It's good to be streaming. Because you can look back and see that I'm not lying. <laughs> I believe you. I mostly do. I can't... Hold on. Okay. I'm just curious if, like, Master Mode has decided to quit on me. Oh. Uh... So oh. Like, okay. yeah. No, I was seeing why I was taking damage, and I forget when you kill the Mother Slime, the Baby Slimes come in. Yeah. Let's see. I don't know, as far as any gaming news I've got lately, I've just been more investigating things from, like, a long time ago for gaming, so, like, they're not particularly interesting. You know, mostly things like, um, games that were going to be made but never did uh, come to fruition, that kind of stuff. Although, uh, that yeah. does remind me, 
Uh, Pedro sent you a game, didn't he? Oh, yeah. Uh, he did send me a game. It is interesting. It is not my kind of game, though. You know, I believe he sent that for me to play. <laughs> it's through the chat. He said that uh, you would send it to me. Oh, yeah, he sent me as a PM. I asked him if he could play. Yeah, uh, it's, um, it's a bullet hell with one level, David. Fine with me. We can play it after Terraria if you can send it. Yeah. Okay. Let's... Saying, might as well keep to the the things that we promised to do. Thanks for vetting the game, Joe. You make sure that like when we win, that there's no like porn that comes out of it unexpectedly. Like it's all good, clean fun. I mean, yeah, it seemed like good, little clean fun. Fuck. Uh. Gotta be worried, Joe. <laughs> it's literally we try to hunt the monster. We have two weapons: a uh, crossbow and um, a magic staff. Are you referring to Terraria still? No, 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 no. I'm referring to the game. The game is called, is called Glorious Hunt. Okay. Is it like uh, but, is it like Dark Souls yeah. inspired or something, Bloodborne? -y? No, no, it's a top down um, top down um, shooter, which basically you're a person and you just have it on your hand, and those are the weapons you use. Like the staff, uh, the staff is a charge shot that does more damage. And then the crossbow has a rapid fire option, and then he has a charge uh, shot that uh, basically eliminates the attacks of the enemy that comes in contact with. Uh, what Pedro said is supposedly if they were going to continue the game, the idea was for them to uh, basically make we different weapons for each boss. Or like change weapons in between each boss. All right. But since it was just a school project, they didn't actually do that. Well, it's it's nice to have those kind of projects in mind. Because I remember when I was in high school, um, a girl was going uh, uh, that her her and her boyfriend were going to make a um, an app together, like a video game app, because he knew how to code. But she didn't know how to write a story, so she asked me for it, and I, like, designed, like, a whole fucking thing, and then he dropped it because... <laughs> uh, I believe the words were, it was supposed to be a special romantic gesture to her, and I ruined it. <laughs> yeah, th that does sound like people. That does That is the kind of chat that you're thinking about. I just find it more funny that it's just, like... You know, she she approached me going like, I don't know how to make a game. You are a gamer. Give me ideas. Well, what if the app game was, since it was a, a response to touch, and we did this and that, and we'd have like three levels, and maybe we are some tadpoles that are happy. That sounds like a, like an award-winning app. She's like, wow, this is a lot of cool th stuff here. I'll send it to my boyfriend. Followed by him just going, you fucking scum. <laughs> okay. These things are tough, man. Well, I don't know what a giant Shelly is. <laughs> Sounds like something from that uh, mod we played. It's, um... It's like a sea snail. You remember the giant clam, right? <laughs> oh god, don't don't make me mind of that. Yeah, are you, are you saying that we ain't doing that? I mean, we are, but... Please don't remind me of that yet, you know, when we can't even beat zombies. You know, that's not in Terraria, right? Oh, I was imagining... I thought it was. Like, I was imagining some terrible shit. No, it's a mod. Besides, that creature wasn't even hard. <laughs> and I, am I just imagining another creature? No. That's very possible, actually. It was in Terraria, but it was a mod. Huh. Okay. Uh... 
It's just that it wasn't hard. Not like some of that other nonsense that was put into the mod. Ah! Oh, Joe, did you clean up some of the corruption? Uh, I like to say yes, but no. Actually, yeah, how would you do that? We don't have the druid yet. I don't know, I just, I just thought the corruption wasn't as corrupted as it was before. Then again, these slimes also feel weaker than they were earlier. I can by the way, uh, I don't think this is worth it. I was checking, um, copper armor, and it does not seem very worth it. I mean, maybe the zombies will stop giving you so quickly, but I, yeah, I wouldn't recommend getting it since we can get gold armor and whatever. But again, you know, if, if we're going to, like, conserve stuff, like, what are we going to use copper for the, for the future? You know, we'll get more of it. So, do as you please. I Joe. mean, the, the only reason I don't want to is because it gives one from... Oh, but yeah, they, they have bonuses when you have a full set, I forget. Yeah, go ahead, make yourself some armor, Joe. No, it's the thing is, like, wood armor is three defense, and and uh, copper armor is four. Okay. You see my problem with this. It's alright, Joe, you can use the copper, like I said, what, what, is, what do we need it for in the future? Copper wiring. Do we? I don't know. But you, even if that's correct, which you know, it probably isn't. Yeah, I know. But like, how much wiring are we going to do that isn't going to be already supplied from the dungeon? I look like the guy from Ghosts and Goblins, now. Well, it helps considering all the. Uh... I feel like they also kill me in two hits. I hope grapefruit is an important item. Uh, I was gonna go with all the graveyards we keep spawning. Yeah, that's fair. And all the ghosts that keep killing us. I'm exploring the mine shaft that we found at the end of the R elevator. Wow. Yeah, there's a lot of good stuff down there. Uh, I'll join you in a bit. I just gotta. Uh... Gotta get a max stack of wood since I'm going to use a million wood in our base down under there. Oh my god. Watch out with the giant shellies, David. Uh, they do some crazy shit. Can't be worse than what I'm going through up here. No, the thing is, these things have, um. Beyond having 150 health, they just sonic the hedgehog at you. I'm think I'm re I'm envisioning the um, starbound things that like have a flip mask. Um, kind of. They all they do like walk slowly like it, and then just move at tremendous speeds. That mm. is the most. I, I remind you that this was game was made by the same people. Hmm. To be honest, uh, starbound is pretty great, and. Uh, I sincerely prefer some of the styles with Terraria. I, I like more the, the fantasy style, but that's just my preference. I want to say Starbound is a more complete game. They are still putting effort into it, but then again, like they put stuff into this too. It's odd that they could make... Uh, that they could just make the same game, essentially. Um... But hey, I believe it was, um, they're not the same people that made the, um, sorry, no, that, that's Cly Entertainment. This is Chucklefish. Cly Entertainment, I was going to say, they're not the same people that made Oxygen Not Included, are they? And they're not. I'm just thinking of things. What else mm -hmm. did Cly Entertainment do? Um, Don't Starve Together? Mm-hmm. I have bad memories with playing Don't Starve Together. That bad? 
I mean, I've played it once. I died in the first five minutes, and then the other people that were playing with me didn't want to restart. Can't they just revive you? No. Yeah. You can or if they can't, they didn't know how, so I just got stuck being a ghost for 45 minutes until I quit. Okay, well, they, they can revive you, they just have to craft something, which... Granted, if you don't know how to play, it would probably take a bit to get everything. Um... But, yeah, you're gonna die a lot in that game. What? This thing is too much, David. No, you. No, no, no! It literally just shot Sonic the Hedgehog is at me. Fine, fine. I can't do I'm, it. I'm gonna put my money in the treasure chest and I'll go see what the hell your problem is. Because I have a magic wand. <laughs> yeah, that's fine. Wow, it's a good thing I went in here. I had a gold on me. That's nice. How many stars do you have, Joe? Oh, I have a blue star that I need to consume. I think one of our tree our trees just lost the top half of it. Possible. Consumed. Oh, let me just destroy some of these so we don't start any graveyards down here. <laughs> graveyards everywhere. Basically. We're getting some sapphire. I'll go get that copper later. Now, truly the important part is... Watch out, let... Oh, 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 oh. Ah! Oh. That's another of my problems. There, the idiot's in the water now. Oh, oh, oh. I haven't seen even seen that yet. We're, I mean, we're sailing into. Oh like, no! Yeah, we're. I'm, ah. I'm out. Mm. That's a spider cavern. That's gonna. Ah! I mean, even these blue jellyfish are hard as nails. You're still fighting those? I mean, yeah. I need something that's on th this direction. Okay. Let's fight him then. Something that might solve this problem. Oh god, there's oh, a bat. bat. I'll get it. Okay, no promises. Mushroom. I agree. Peach. No, what's that? That's not the jelly. Like, when I complain to you about one thing, that's, everything that's not that appears. That's a crawdad. Okay, that thing. Yeah. Oh, it's still there! Oh, there's two of us now. I'm scared. <laughs> okay, it's not attacking. Good. Oh, no. What? Okay, we're flanking it. <laughs> Don't sail into it! You understand the problem I was having with that? No. <laughs> How many stars do you have? I I had one. Uh, I have two now. Okay. Um. Here you go, Joe. Fuck you too. Then. Take it. Craft it into oh, a man star. Oh, no Craft it into oh, a man no, star. I, no, I. 
You gave me one. No, you gave me two. Did I? See, three. Yeah. yeah Alright, I'll just, uh... I... I'll talk. This looks tight as fuck to me, though. Oh! <laughs> David! No! As soon as you run, man, I you, I should have had that man start. Damn it, Joe! <laughs> I need to escape. David, sacrifice can't be in vain. Uh, no, it will be in vain, David. Sorry. Well, bring it over. Bring it. Well, you got the demonite, right? Yep, that's what I was uh, after. I'm honestly surprised you could craft demon, or like cut up the demonite. I thought we needed a better pick. I have gold. Oh, is that what you're cutting it up with? Yeah. Huh. There we go. Okay, David. I stopped playing around. What'd you, uh, what you got? Fucking archery. All right. Well, then I hope you hope you'll do good on that. What the fuck's down there? What's that? You see? Oh, goldfish. Yeah, they're everywhere. What's up with that? <laughs> they looked really weird to me because they were just like there's torches on them. I thought they were like little golden statues. I mean, they look really weird because they're walking. <laughs> it was like, eh, chill. <laughs> Like, some do that, some do that. I don't know. Apparently I had, like, wood paneling in three different inventory spots. Don't do that, that doesn't make your inventory much, much shorter. Yeah, I'd say. Oh, but, um... But yesterday I played the, um... Like, Game of Thrones games with a couple extra rules. Okay. And I, I was playing it for the first time, and I was the only one. I, I very much define my own way of winning by not losing. This is like one of those things where like you you win through like poor like like you know the like by winning the like you know the band word game Joe. Oh uh yeah, but no, it's more uh you need to conquer castles. And at the end of the game, the person who has more castles, or that, uh, or in a, in a tie, the person that's ahead in like a thing uh, you have to bid on, like um, an order for the, the Iron Throne, gets to the side who wins. Hmm. So basically, it's a game that's about um, you have to manage your provisions. But you also can't be stingy while bidding for the the three positions, which basically is the the one that controls war. You basically decide in ties of uh, when someone ties in a battle, David. You can decide who wins from those two. Uh, the Iron Throne who decides every tie, uh, except in battle. And then the Raven, who can see basically what the board. There's like there's a communal thing, which is the wildlings that attack. The Raven gets to see what's going to happen, or just change one of his orders to mess with the other players. So it's a game that's important to ally yourself to people. Wow, like the real <laughs> show. Oh, uh, but yeah. Yeah. <laughs> it's it's an interesting game. And people get hurt in that game, their feelings at least. Oh. It's like Monopoly, like, like, you know, people are gonna get upset. -y. I mean, yeah, because it's like in Monopoly, you can make alliances and make deals. Just so many, I literally. So many memories yeah. of people who just got, like, upset enough at, like, tabletop games that. They just, like, refuse to interact with you anymore. Great. I mean, yes, but... Like, I was thinking, like, especially for you, since you GM. 
Yeah. That's a lot of people. It's like, so have you ever played Pokemon, Joe? Uh, sorry, what? You've ever, have you ever played Pokemon? Pokemon. Yeah, the card game. Oh, yes, I've right, played I'm, the card game a few times. I'm still referring to, you know, the the tabletop of things. If there's a if there's a Pokemon board game, I mean, hit me up. But uh, I mean, probably is. Oh, I'm sure. Let's be honest. Like there was a weird Harry Potter thing, but that's that's besides the point. Um, you know, like the the. I guess the way I should word this is, you know how kids will, like, take uh, the Pokemon card game and they'll play it, but they won't know the rules? Yes, that's mostly what I did. Hey, people. Um, Silt Ball, you gotta stop collapsing that roof on yourself. But I'm not! I'm on top of it! Uh, yeah, what was I going on about? Um, the... It's the kind of thing where people, because I okay, so I guess let me preface this with the story of like when I was younger, uh, my other uh, kids in my neighborhood played Pokemon by like amassing a deck of like every fucking card they owned and then just slapping them down and saying they like, aha, this happens. Like they they read with the cards that like Charizard had like a fire blast that required like six fire energy and shit, but they're like. Uh, and it's that's too hard. We don't know how that works. We're just gonna slap down the Charizard card and say it can do the Fire Blast constantly. Which leads into stupid shit. This isn't like, oh, it was a Charmander first, even. It's just they, they drew the, Char the Charizard, and they played it, and then they just had it Fire Blast literally every card, one after another. One, like, dead, 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 right? Yeah, I understand. And it wasn't like, oh, we play until six cards are defeated or whatever, so, like, there's some randomness. You play until your entire fucking deck is used. Uh, <laughs> and I... And again, just because just I remember every every wrong that's ever uh, gone against me, Joe. Uh, the... <laughs> oh, let me check if this house is good. Um... I'm curious. Um, I guess it doesn't yeah. technically need this, does it? Is that thing... Oh, that thing had a gold on it! Probably from one of us dying to it a lot. Um... Don't say that. Don't say the truth. Get up. Yeah, go ahead. Alright. Um, the, but, you know, my, my, uh... Yes, I'll keep going one, along with you, yeah. Yeah, sorry, I'm, I guess I'm just trying to find a nice way of saying, oh, you know, one day I got a Kabutops card, and it's, it, it had the ability that whenever it damaged, it healed from that damage. So, that became the new card that when I played it, nothing could stop it, and they wrote, and someone went, it's really unfair how it just heals after every attack it does, so we can't ever kill it. How about we just say it doesn't do that anymore, and that's what... The people who were playing the game wrong decided to start using their own rules. I mean, yeah. No, I know, I'm just... I find it funny that that's where, like, the line begins. Where, you know... I mean, the line begins when they start winning, uh, losing constantly. Yeah, it's like, um, when, when we played Yu-Gi-Oh! after, like, shortly thereafter, Childhood's a Breeze, which is card games in my neighborhood, um, you know, we were playing the game correctly for the most part. Like, we, were, we had some fun, like, home rules on it, but it was actually pretty much just, like, us actually playing, you know? My, my the only thing I, like, after the, uh, being 10... The only thing I really did wrong at in Yu-Gi-Oh, David, is uh, trap card usage. Uh, for the girl I was going to throw under the bus, uh, what she always did was, uh, you know how the monsters have like stars and you like five, you require a sacrifice. Yeah. She would always pop down. Um, what is it? 
Uh, it was like a football player card that had like 3,000 defense or something, but it was a 5 star. And she would always just pop it down, face down, and no sacrifice. Oh. Uh, what? Sorry, what do you say uh, the card was? It was like a football player. Oh, that's a 4 star. No, no. No, uh, Cody used it yesterday. No, no, no. Yeah, it's the 2010, de uh, 2010 deck. Battle footballer. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Are you sure it wasn't Millennium Shield? No, I'm pretty sure it was this card. Can you pop down four stars without sacrifices? Yeah. Man, then we didn't know how to play. Um, <laughs> <laughs> Debunked. Right. Yep. Thanks, thanks for uh, making her in the right, ultimately. Although, I do believe everybody agreed that it required a sacrifice. You know what she might have had? You know how there was like those knockoff cards? Yeah, I had a bunch of them. Because I distinctly remember it having enough stars. Like, we counted and goes, this requires a sacrifice. And I'm like, like, oh yeah. And then she would go, yeah, but we don't want to, you know, go all the way back to seven turns ago when I placed it face down. Because I believe what we did was we did uh, three-way duels of people because we're... F oh! Uh, we're scum. That's just funnier. here. Yeah. Also, that's the thing. Like, the show doesn't play the card game correctly. So, I, that's, I'm going to bullet that on the show. Um... But... There was a lot that we took from, like, inspiration from the show, because there was that, um, that arc where they were all, um, like, they, they chose, like, my deck master and some, like, nonsense. Yeah, happened. yeah. And we were like, we want to have deck masters. So I made up what every person decided their deck master should do. It was fairly balanced, because I did it. Uh, no, um. Yeah. I mean, that's. I love that, because David, don't forget, that was literally the season that was made purely by four kids. It was fun. Uh, <laughs> uh, like the movie that also had more... <laughs> like the movie that had the capsule monsters, so they could sell a game. Dungeon Dice Monsters is the fucking hottest shit, what are you talking about? No, no. Dungeon, Di Dungeon Dice Monsters is, and I love the Game Boy video game. I meant... Yu-Gi-Oh! Capsule Monsters. Ah. I need to go to the surface again and get some more mushrooms. Mm, I still have three. Oh. I should go back up, because I do have a lot of money. How much money are we talking? I mean, almost two gold. Fucking, why are you still down here? Oh, fairy! Does that heal you or something? I don't know. It just... They're like, um... Oh, it's it's so Here, David. weird. Here, I'll keep digging. Here you go. How dare you. <laughs> I mean, you said you were going up. Oh, I said you should go up, but whatever. Oh, whoops, almost died. You literally said, I'm going up, I need more mushrooms. No, I said we should go up. <laughs> Then I didn't hear you correctly. And then you said, we, I still have two, and I'm like, oh. <laughs> I'm not gonna survive, Joe. It's coming after me. <laughs> I have no Coming. time. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, jeez. Coming after me now. <laughs> I gathered its attention. Go, fly, you fool! I'm I'm going to the base as fast as I can jump. I should start. We should, we should uh, keep we should keep the elevator going a little bit. Yeah. 
So that two means gold. I'll, well, that means I'll need to break the rails. We don't have to break the rails. We can just have a chunk error right there. The rails sure. can, Yeah, the rails can stay up. If you, have you not seen that? I've been putting doors all across the wall. No. Yeah. There's like four doors in this wall so far. Some of them are just holes, but they're holes on the side that the corruption doesn't spread, so whatever. Okay. Did you break them and now you're putting them back in? Yes. What a slub. I mean, at least I didn't lie. What the hell are you doing? <laughs> I'm getting rid of the water. Okay, this doesn't get rid of the water. How do we make sponges? Uh, you have to kill Duke Fishron. Why do we need to kill a legendary bar uh, boss for actual for actual um, appliances? You could also just make uh, like a million buckets, but what I personally do is you can flood hell. Uh oh, oh yeah, let's do this. Joe's like, ooh, flooding hell. I like the sound of that. Yeah, flooding things. It's fun in it. Sure not, but it is. <laughs> I do this and like, oh, so that's why all those people are in jail. You and your wacky stories. Um, so since we're going to uh, leave a hole here for the rails, we want to get a good distance away from everything else here. Like, just getting rid of some of the basic materials for the hole. Sorry, what? We're leaving the rails so that you can still go through them. So, we you see how yeah. I've, I've stopped here? Yeah. You do that. And, you know, all that fun stuff. Yeah, I'm just digging a bit here so the water can come in. I should leave some of the stuff I have in the... or chests up there. Still? No, no, no. I, I was just making this uh, longer so more water can come this way. Hmm. We could also go with the method of drowning ourselves. I mean, how far from hell are we? We're about a third of the way there. I mean, we found demonite, and that's the best thing we got from here. Do you have a demonite pick? No, I'm in a yo yo. I have my priority straight. That's right, you did make a yo yo. And I didn't recommend you for that. Uh. I mean, I am killing things efficiently now. I guess I can't fault you for that. I mean, especially after the first 10 minutes of this session, David, if you remember. Yeah, no, I'll give you that. You deserve that yo-yo after suffering. <laughs> By the way, what? don't... Like, when you're... Um, <laughs> When you're dig digging uh, silt blocks, don't stay in another silt block. They'll kill you. Fun to know. Because <laughs> like, cause this is the thing, David, you see the silt block here, right? I, d I, like, I dug them from like this side, and they still killed me for some reason. <laughs> I wonder how many purists are, like, upset at 1.4, then. I 
Make a, make a bit of a hole. Oh god, Joe. Yeah? There's wallpaper here. Bring out the hammers, boys. I like that you call it wallpaper, not even background. Well, it is. Oh no, my screensaver. Oh! That made me remember. Hey, Joe, have you ever had that screensaver? Like, you know, the thing where it's like, um. It's like a game where it's a screensaver? Like, the screensaver itself is a game that you can play? No, I did not. What's that? It's the weirdest thing. Oh, hey, we finally got the merchant. We got a piggy bank. Um, I remember it no, used no, to. Departed. He arrived a while ago. Oh, fuck. What was he selling? Oh, no. Well, I guess us poor boys will never know. He'll come back. Um, so it was he something... He always comes back. Yeah, it was something like, um... I can't remember the name of the store, but they had, like, this cow print going on for them. And, uh, I was always... I mean, you know, I'm a young nerd at you age mean, six. You mean Ale Hop? Hmm? Ale Hop? Maybe that's what they were called where you're from. Uh, I'm gonna stand here so you can protect me while I go look up what they're called. Like, Ale Hop literally has a cow figurine from the most stores. Uh, they were called Gateway. Oh, well, that's stupid. What's yours called? Ale Hop. You're trying to say Ali Oop or Ali Hop? A L E the dash H O P. Okay, Ali Hop. Yeah, estamos de vuelta, estamos abriendo nuestras tiendas progresivamente, y hemos tomado today la media necessary for Portuguese and... Hold on, what's a Porto Journos mean? Sorry, what? What's Porto... What's Sorry, what's Proto Journos? I'm not familiar with that word. Uh, okay, S please send me the word on Discord so I can... That's that's true. I might be pronouncing it all sorts of wrong. Sorry. Um, Proto Journos. Yeah. Like that. Oh, protect us. Oh. Okay. It's a quarantine announcement. Okay. <laughs> it's a quarantine announcement. You know, I should have gone that when I was talking about saying stay at home. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah. Sorry, Spanish is a bit rusty. <laughs> also, I guess it's Portuguese for you, isn't it? I mean, it actually, with that word, I think can be both. Well, no, that's what I'm saying. The only reason I know any Portuguese is because I know Spanish. And that's, that's using, that's, that's a very loose term of me saying knowing Spanish. <laughs> oh, there's another mine here, David. Good, that's making the elevator job really easy, Joe. No, no, like, a a actual mine with the minecart. Well, I mean, some poles aren't bad. We're just gonna have to make sure that we get the backdrops gone. Uh, you can, oh, how many amethysts do I have? I might wanna pop uh, in here while you can, Joe. Sorry, what? Oh, yeah. Uh, sorry, I was checking how many amethysts until I can actually make you, um, this. Oh yeah, because you're scum. <laughs> wow, whoops, I didn't want to make a workbench, damn it. What'd I make two? <laughs> That'll work out. Oh shit, this worked. Yeah, I'm alright. Oh, no, not anymore. Yeah. It's 
uh, it's like having vision super dandy, isn't it? I mean, yeah, but you can't always have vision. Uh, just a second. I think I can make you a gold pickaxe. Okay, that'd help a bit. Why does it... Ah, this game's super weird with the quick stack. I forget the button to autocraft a lot of things. Autocraft? I just use a mouse. What are you on? No, no, no. I I'm on a mouse. I like. I think there was a button before to just like craft every item possible with this amount, of, like with the what we what you have. I don't know. Uh, mm, I s I'm slightly short for a pickaxe. It's all good. We'll get some more materials as we venture down. Oh, wait. What? Guy, merchant's still here because he can't leave. Wait, the zombie merchant? No, the merchant. Wait, usually he just despawns once he's off screen. No, he's still here, David. The piggy bank is ninety silver. Come, come. Oh, that's not the mer the traveling merchant. That's the regular ass merchant. Oh, you already have the piggy bank? No, fucking get it. I, I died. It's said 90 silver. Joe, there's a treasure yeah. chest full of our money. Oh yeah, we do have money. Granted, I'm afraid it's all my money at this point, considering the way you just said that. <laughs> no, I gave a gold. I gave a gold and 79 silver yeah. for this. See, look, I knew that was going to be his house. That's why I made it so nice and big, so we can make it nicer looking later. Uh... Shop, he has mining helmet, piggy, okay, piggy bank, got him. 90 silver, because it, it's master mode, is everything cheap? Or is it always that cheap? Uh. I don't remember, um, I'm gonna put it, can I, can I put it, wait. You can move the keg if you're gonna put it there. Usually I just slam the piggy bank right next to him. Like next to who? The merchant. Oh, yeah, then let's do that. Let me put the money there. That's, uh, you just took all our money, huh? Oh, then let me put it back on the chest. No, what's fucking whatever. You can enjoy it. I'll get. We'll make more money, Joe. Besides, so, you bought the piggy bank. It's all good. D. And. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> or in French, DK. No, okay, let's go. I'm curious. What's this happiness thing about? I don't recall that. Me neither. I greatly appreciate it. Wait, can I force people to live together? They're they're happy that they don't have to share a house. Can I force them to live together? No. What the fuck's up with that dialogue? The happiness thing's new. I would, oh, whatever. We can check it. Oh my god. What? Uh, do you remember those things that I said at Sonic at you? Um. The Shellies. Yeah, I just don't remember, remember shooting Sonic, but go on. No, it's basically, um. Since they can throw themselves, I, I, I stuck myself to the ceiling. And one of them just went inches from me and didn't hit me. Huh. 
kind of kind of don't mind. In oh. fact, I think I'll do this. Oh. Yes. No, please die. Please die. So so angry. You wouldn't mind perishing. Damn. But what is this I got? I was right. Yay, David. Yeah. I got a equipable thing. What? I got an angry compass. An angry compass? Yeah, it's a trinket. The first trinket of the game. Well, at least someone got it. Also, do you want the zombie arm to beat people with? No, stop handing me those every game we play. I mean, I don't know. It's better than your weapons. I have a wand. Be honest, it's actually better than that, too. No. The wand's ranged. Here. And this, the new, the music from since the Terraria update have been really like happy sounding. Like you can really hear that it's like different than what it originally was. Yeah, which I don't appreciate in this master mode, to be honest. Because it's so happy sound like being. Yeah. Because the game is fucking mean, but he's trying to sound happy. Like the yeah, Joe's the kind of person. <laughs> I'm the kind of person that what? What, David? You know what? Uh. I am the confused. You're the, you're the kind of person that takes the uh, the happy music and goes. It's telling me. It's it's it hates me. I mean, accurate, why? Why are you saying that? This poor rabbit should not have come to a construction zone. I'll die. Oh. Uh, yeah, that, that's a good strategy for most things. It is not. Do not. Do not quote me on that. Joe had given me a hook shot, I wouldn't be in this predicament. 
I'm going to find them just Hey Pager. Oh my god. Mm. We talked about your video game. Yeah, Joe hates it. But I'll still give god it a shot. <laughs> you suck, David. Joe, do you want a mining potion? It'll make your speed go up by 25%. I know in our usual games we like hoard potions like greedy little like dwarves, but uh, honestly, it's master mode. We should probably just you know accept that we should use things. I mean, to be fair, well, well currently I'm not doing the most mining because there's a new mine shaft, and that just means exploring. That's true. You're being a pointless waste of space. Oh, well, David, thanks. You're welcome. Why do I keep making this harder on myself? Because you hate yourself. Wait, I didn't see him. do you think the uh, the final sessions of the Friday campaign are going to go? Uh, well, uh, I would prefer not to talk that much about it, because uh, Pedro hasn't seen the... Uh, and hasn't finished anything. Yeah, that's, fine, that's fair. We can be uh, kind towards our audience. But or you, one audience, yes. Yeah. Well, if other people are coming into the here, but I think they're just seeing us and dropping out, which, you know, fair if we're, if, uh, fair if we're not what they want to see, like, you know, how are you up to them? Why is the rain wet, Red? I don't know. Why do I hear boss I music? Uh, it... Why uh, is this red? Oh, dun, dun. oh no. Let's see, what's the, uh, the old saying as it was the 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 friend the, the, like do you think you're going to try to uh no idea how that happened do you think that the um you'll 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 try or do you think you're just gonna let it rest on cody's hands though it the the thing is i'm not pursuing him if he comes back, it's going to be a different matter. Because mm. the problem is, I can't only totally worry about him. I have two people who actually cannot fight. That's, that's rude to Nathan. He succeeded. <laughs> no, no, I understand he succeeded, but um, goblins and orcs are different. <laughs> yeah, I'll, I'll stop prying since you don't want to ruin the story for uh, Pedro. Yeah. It's a bit of a shame that our uh, smite stream ended, though. Like, it didn't transfer. Yeah, it's a shame. I did tell them about our score. Because yesterday they gave me a controller. They gave but you... I said it was the lucky controller. Yeah, mm -hmm. they gave me a PlayStation controller, because one of mine was messed up. Hmm. They're good friends. Nice. So I was missing those shots because I was really anticipating the fact that they would have, like, you know, jumped between, but apparently not. Yeah. I'm trying to dig underwater because I found more demonite.
Whoa. These doors opening up automatically are dangerous, Joe. And yeah. I think you can turn that off if you really want. Nah, I don't care. Oh. Uh, hasn't really killed me yet. Being the keyword. Yep. Well, I'm just happy that probably today we'll be able to continue the Obito game. Yeah, hopefully. I'll just have to tell everyone, no one gets sick, no one falls asleep. Fuck everything. <laughs> You've lost the right to sleep as soon as you join the campaign. That's what it feels like. <laughs> Some days you can just get nothing done. Oh, and the fact that like it's like a hundred degrees at where I'm at. How about you, Joe? Um, it's fairly the climate's pretty good right now. For like a couple days it was like hot and rainy. Uh, but now it's um, it's more to the hot, not extremely hot. So we're we're starting with a pleasant summer summer after a lot of rain. Hmm. I guess it. It makes me uh, think, what's, where is it from? Uh, wasn't somewhere for a lot of rain. Sorry, you just, you remind me of like a story I heard, but again, you know, if, if we weren't streaming, I'm sure I would be able to like effortlessly recall things, but you know, I have to look stupid, so there you go. <laughs> yeah, no, it is a requirement for streamers. I'm sure I've always had that problem where I just couldn't remember things very well. Yeah, your memory is garbage. Thanks for being such a good friend, Joe. If it weren't for my memory, I think I would remember to not be friends with you. <laughs> um. <laughs> you only reminded yourself what kind of shit you've said to me. Then you just ask yourself, why am I friends with you? Low standards. And, uh... <laughs> uh fair. When will the line cross from, uh, teasing to bully, and who knows? Uh... <laughs> Probably never if we do it to each other. Eh. Friend. Anyways. And that's the line between friends, when they know where it's too far and when they can bully each other. That's true. There's always that, like... I keep thinking of, like, old parables that aren't quite as necessary as they should be, so I'll... I'm, I'm trying not to, like, bore you with them. Uh, I, sp mm. I suppose it could be better summed as, a. Uh... It's nice to know the way people can interact with one another. Yeah. Oh, Bone Merchant. Bone Merchant. Hello, Bony Boy. No eyed Willy. What? What an awful name. Of. Uh, Less restoration. Oh no 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 no! no. What you uh? What's wrong now, Joe? Oh no, just a bat attacking me. Hmm. Another bat. Oh bats! I see. Uh, this guy has a uh, green counterweight, some wooden arrows, bombs, rope. Oh, you want to buy two of those counterweights so we can make yo-yo bags? I mean, yeah, but it's half gold. It's not worth it yet. Alright, yeah, if you think you'll find him again. God, I, don't I know mean, it's so just a bone merchant. Some of these stairs, like, I fall right through. Like, I'm not, I'm not pressing any button other than that. Like, see, it works there. But other times I'll just fall through at random. It's the weirdest shit. 
No, you can dig yourself out. Yeah, be kind to the one viewer. Only I can pull it myself, and I don't. I do it many times. Pedro's the kind of dude that Avengers Endgame comes out, and he starts looking up spoilers immediately, and gets, gets mad. Is that what it is? I don't remember. Pedro, you that are there, did you see the freaking the spoilers uh, that someone leaked for, um... What's that game? Zombie game. Uh, Last of Us, a new one. Did you do that for yourself, Pedro? I don't remember. I think... I know you've talked about this, but I don't remember. Oh, that's grim. No, get me out of here. <laughs> that's a real grim. What's wrong, Joe? Close to the uh, close to our mine shaft. If you go a bit down, there's just like a corpse skeleton with a sword through it. Could be worse. I just noticed. I said corpse skeleton. Yeah, it could be worse. I mean, I guess since skeletons can move in this world, I guess it makes sense. Oh yeah, uh, this still reminds me, I still have to very much think if I want to use, um, Animate Dead in my, uh, co the, the cook, the guy from the cooking show that you're going to do. I like the idea of you using Animate Dead just to make, like, uh, like a, of, you know, how, like, there's some tell, like, cook, uh, cooking people, like, or, like, TV personalities. It just shows your yeah. crowd and they're just all the, like, all the fucking skeletons just sitting there going... Now for our far star host, you know Necrocon, the te the terrible necromancer, and all the skeletons are just going, yay! <laughs> My, mm, I might do that. I just like the idea of like a, an audience going, ooh, it's just full of skeletons. Yeah. I love that uh, they would start clapping and just you just hear like rattling as they <laughs> shuck their bones together. Okay, I'm going to try. Okay, let me get rid of these real fast. I'm going to try and uh... what's the word I'm looking for? We want me to uh, go find Billy, right? Uh. Sorry, Billy? Uh, the little fisherman kid. Oh. I mean, yeah, if you want to go find Billy. I know he has the fishing missions that give you stuff. Yeah, I've, I've already done 200 of those. I'm not doing another one. But, uh, you know, for the fact that we want to just have him in our village, might as well, right? I mean, yeah, I also found a good thing. Yeah? Another heart container. Okay, crack it and bring it my way if you can. Yep, I'm just... I just need to get to it first. So, which end do you think Billy is on? Um, the end you're probably not going to go through. So you're aware you which, which end Billy is always on, right? No. He's always on the side of the dungeon. Oh, I'm sorry. I think that's right, but now that I said that out loud, I bet I'm thinking it's the opposite. Well, I'll find out soon enough. <laughs> the pain. I'm traveling the world. Horrible to explain. Oh god, I'm gonna die a bunch. Oh, what the hell killed me? I think I took damage from walking into the, um... You know how the corruption has those, like, red prickly things that damage you? Yeah. I just died to that. I mean, that's fairly normal. Not really. I don't have enough health to bolster myself. It deals 15 damage. I'm not sure if it's because I'm not wearing armor or because it's master mode. I mean, I told you, Silt has been dealing me 30 to 50 damage. 
I'm reading Pedro here. Uh, the habit of while watching, for example, an anime in the last episode ends on a cliffhanger where a character may or may not die. I go and see if that character is alive or not. Why aren't skeletons slowed in a nude speech? Because they can't control their boners. But I'm just... <laughs> I'm laughing just because Pedro's telling jokes to himself. Um... No, Pedro, I, I'm kind of the same way. Am I clipping, by the way, when I speak? Because I keep getting, like, a on my own end, like, a reverb. No, no. You're doing... I can hear you perfectly. I just assume my uh, headphones being a bit wonky then. Uh, but, yeah, I mean, like... Ouch. Son of a bitch. By the way, David, since you're here... Let me... Um... Yeah, come to me at the exit where we have the forge and stuff. Sure. Um, but yeah, like, when when an anime ends on, like, season one, and you don't think they're ever gonna, like, continue it, but you like it, or hell, I got to, like, season two, episode six of an anime, and decided I'm just gonna go ahead and read the entire fucking manga now. Um. Which one was that? Uh, Kaguya-sama. Oh. I genuinely like it. Which, you know, probably has to do with the fact that constantly in the manga it's writing you know you guys never thought we would go far because we're a romance manga that doesn't have gratuitous panty shots like, like the fucking artist is like haha fuck you I've made it I mean there is a good stance to have sorry I'm, I'm trying to find it on the phone there we go Nice. Which button is that? Alright, found it. Are you going to throw me a heart container? Uh, yep. Here you go. Thank you. I'm going to go and try to find Billy now. Alright. See what Pedro says. Oh, I have... Monster airstrike. David, before you go, I have one last gift. Oh, thanks. You can sell this. Oh, excuse me. Uh, but yeah, from reading the Kagu Sama thing, I just want to say that uh, the that you character Ishigami or whatever, he's just the he's the fucking best character. Oh yeah. He's. <laughs> He just, he just speaks like he's a 4chan user. To be fair, like, I, like, if you tell me about this anime, I might remember, but I don't think I've watched it. Ugh. There's no knockback in this game, or the pickaxe has no knockback, who knows. Pickaxe does very little knockback, yeah. Uh, but, uh... Tell me, please, the premises of that anime to see if I've watched it. Uh, there are two geniuses that are fall in love with each other, but they don't want to admit it, so they're trying to get the other one to confess. Oh, oh, that one, okay, yeah. Sorry, I I'm just not used to hearing the title of it. There's, there's like five fucking mangas around it. It's, it's amazing yeah. how weirdly popular it is. Um... That being said, I just fucking like the fact that you will, like, every time he shows up, he's just like, what's up, my dudes? <laughs> yeah, now I remember Ishigami. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah uh, I've, also, I've been following the manga, and since I've, I've been following the manga, I decided not to watch the anime. Yeah, I'm not in a great spot here. Oh. Uh Tell you what, Joe, we're not, uh, we're not strong enough to leave home. <laughs> I look at you, I wasn't not strong enough to be home either, so. I also have the habit of searching the wiki, uh, wikis for things like explanations on powers and, and mechanics on anime, anime mangas, and while I usually end up accidentally getting spoilers. For example, like, I saw two episodes of Reincarnated as a Slime. I went to the wiki for a small thing and ended up getting multiple spoilers just on the first few lines of the wiki. Yeah, that sucks, Pedro. 
Though yeah. as as you I were mean, as Pedro was explaining himself there, I was recalling like seeing a screenshot from um, a certain scientific railgun. Not a screenshot, like a clip. Is what is what I meant? But what I'm what I'm more confused about is like what the hell is that show about? Because I thought it was like a romance thing at first. Nope. It's um. It's more of a sci-fi superpower thing because the it's a spin-off of the original, the Magical Index. Was that the romance thing? Uh, it's a romance in the most broad sense of the word, I guess. Because like people love the main character, it's more of a sh like magic it's, it's shonen. Like a sh shonen. More than okay. well, I don't know, because like I know there was that um. The word there was that let me get down here first there's a graveyard in this cavern joe well, how did you die so much many things killed me um but uh so if i remember correctly there are three that came from that anime which oh another art container uh which was the accelerator one that one. The, the sheer mention of Excel got me thinking about Excel World, and that <laughs> that's just ugh. go on. Um, and the the original one, Magical Index, is about basically this uh, girl that was hidden from the whole world that has these mysterious powers that can do like ancient forgotten magic or something of the sort. Some sort of nonsense, like, gotcha. Yeah. The main character is, like, is a fully normal dude, except his left hand can, um... It, the demon like, hand. Anything that, no, but no, David, it's a completely normal hand, but anything that is, like, magical, demonic, mutant, that he touches with it, he cancels. So you see the rail gun doing like the, the fucking lightning against him, just cancel that shit. Is this the anime where this guy goes around punching girls constantly? Yes. Yeah, I remember there was some reason that I had this in my watch list. No, cause yeah, cause this is the thing. If people throw lightning at you, I think gender stops mattering at all. Oh no, I just like the fact that I think uh, like the character, the characters did that thing where like. Uh, like, I like Kazuma's character, because he doesn't ha like, he doesn't take that shit. Where he goes, I am, like, a true advocate of gender equality. Because the second, like, the, like, anyone just tries to use their gender as an advantage to him, he's like, nah. <laughs> <laughs> I see. Punch! No, but yeah, I think the, the name of the fist is the clean, yeah, it's like, a ima like, a, uh, uh, like, imagination breaker or something of the sort. Some sort of nonsense. That ghost yeah. is, uh, that ghost down there is bugging me out. Where are you in the elevator efforts, Joe? Uh, mining. Not in the elevator, but mining in general. I finally found the orange, leave me alone. You're way the hell over there. I don't really have anything to I'm bringing the ghost friend to you. Okay. Wow. This world really isn't as big as I think it is. Like, when you're saying this, I think, I think you left the ghost, like, back there. Got a life crystal. Oh, you got one too? Is there a fucking wa Oh god, Joe. Oh. Yeah? I think we found natural gym trees. Nice. Oh, there's a trap close to there. Well, I got a life crystal, so whatever. <laughs> I'm gonna kill you. I bet. Oh. <laughs> Damn their ability to see sonar. Why didn't you use your 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 sling? Why didn't you use your um thingy? 
I read a few chapters of a certain scientific railgun, and they didn't keep my attention. The series is weird. Yeah, the one screenshot I saw was like that, or not? I don't know why I keep calling a clip a screenshot. Uh, but yeah, the one clip I saw was like that, where it was like more weird than like I don't know. It's like the th problem I have with starting Hunter X Hunter is like you just keep seeing it. I'm thinking like it just seems like a generic shonen trash, and I know it's not. Stop screaming at me, Joe. Uh, I was about to. I just have a hard time getting into it. Like, I feel like I missed the, like, age requirement to see it. Fuck. <laughs> just because too many characters are children does not mean it's a children's show. Yeah. I know. It doesn't help that the adult in the show is useless. I mean, some of them are, some of them aren't. This introduction of graveyards has made the game much harder. Yes. Oh! Nice job, bro. Why weren't you looking where you were going? I'm, <laughs> <coughs> I'm dying! I'm more concerned of having lose, lost a gold. Don't worry, Joe. I'll find out where you died. It's somewhere over here, right? <laughs> Just see that, like, David got snapped by a poison dart. I'm like, yay, it was there. Found another life crystal. What's your health at, Joe? Like 140. Fuck. Why are my torches not in here? I should make more torches. You're right. summons because I can't aim. <laughs> oh. Okay, Joe, I'm coming at you with a life crystal. The show has more blood on one character than all seasons of Naruto, both classic and Shippuden. Doesn't Naruto culminate with them destroying the moon? I would say there's a lot of blood oh, in Naruto for that. What, Joe? That's a movie. You're making it sound like it's not part of the series. I mean, it is, but it's more of a prologue thing than an actual... Like, a ship or an ending. Isn't that the movie that has, like, the, the Hinata Naruto romance? Yeah. That's, that's why I meant my prologue. Yeah. I think the real problem is I haven't seen any Naruto past a certain point, and yet I know this. Dude, uh, like, uh, I mean, you know that because I told you. Is it? And it's not just because osmosis of animes? I mean, ah! no, because, like, I think we even spoke of it in stream about this uh, a specific part of Naruto. I just, I don't know, I guess... I like Shonen. It's just, it's a certain point, shit, like, hits ridiculous levels. Like, you know there was that anime... I didn't even finish watching it, because as far as I was aware, like, down with, it was finished. Where people use, like, puppets to control shit to fight for them, but this dude just used, like, his fucking muscles and stuff, like, he was just like, oh, a yeah. martial artist. And he had some yeah, stupid shit where, like, if he didn't make someone laugh, he died. Yeah. You know what I'm talking about? It, but it... Yeah, it's pretty great. Just, are you sure? Because I just stopped watching it in the middle, because I'm like, it's good, it's good, as far as I'm aware. That, you know, the guy just has this whole fucking tournament arc against all the big bads. 
and he becomes like a half a puppet man. And after he wins, it just goes to him being like a mysterious loner thing. And it's supposed to focus on the boy's journey after that. And I'm just like, no, I, I think I'm not. I think I'm good. <laughs> No, he comes back. This thing, me and Stefan love that that one. Clearly, need this light crystal. Sorry, Joe. Oh, no worries. Uh, but me and Stefan do love that one, David. It, I don't know. Like it, it's got really stupid. But it's the kind of stupid where like where you're like, yeah. Uh, but <laughs> I don't know. Yeah. I I hated that that child character so much. I mean, if I told you he sacrificed himself for everyone else, would you watch it? No. And... <laughs> Damn it. I mean, you, I still prefer you, to you to watch Hunter x Hunter, so yeah, do that. You, you told me the quintuplets anime- I'm not even touching the, the controller anymore, the fucking velocity on this thing is wild. Um... I mean, I told you... I never told you it was good. You said it didn't end with a harem. Technically doesn't. It does. Now this is just technicality. He marries one of them, but he gets together with all of them, so he does. No, I don't know what you're talking about, David. Uh. Ooh! Finally, a useful potion. Uh, he gets together with all of them because after he marries one of them, uh, they all join him on their honeymoon and they make like salacious comments that appear as if, you know, that they're gonna share him. Which, you know, even if it's not true, it's the kind of thing where you're like, ah, yes, it's a hair mending. You know, because, I mean, I get, I'm still upset with the girl that he ultimately ends up choosing. Because at the first thing, you're like, oh, she gets with this person when you spoiled it. And I'm just like, that's fine with me. And then you watch the, sh the watch it and you're like, she didn't deserve to win. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like, that's that, uh, but you're like, no, no, it's okay. I'm like, no, it's not. It's boring. I am fine with her winning on the basis that, like, the character would choose a boring answer like that, but, you know. I mean, the thing is, to be honest, David, like, first character, like, he literally, um, if the choice, um, w without being on his side, was literally she had dibs. I don't know, I think it was, like, I can understand a person choosing, like, the least high-maintenance thing. No, yeah, that's completely fair. I just Ow. truly hate that some of their explanations why... It, like the others are okay with it is that she had dibs on him okay then i mean you, you... otherwise you're gonna get in, like i think they wanted they didn't want to end it on a you know people are mad at each other ending you know which would have been way more real I'm finding a oh, I'm... gold pretty well without you, Joe. Yeah, uh, I'm... I'm just even more deep down right now. I hope you f you're finding good stuff. Let me see what Pedro has been responding uh... to. The F is that series. Harem ending, but if things go bad, he only needs one divorce paper. Jesus. Well, since I think, whenever I think of, like, what I, what the first harem in the game, like, the world probably was, or, like, the first successful one, like, the thing that made it, like, harems, you know? I oh, we're having this conversation again. 
Well, yeah, like, I, like, I don't know, people defend Tenshi Muyo, and, like, I don't know, it's, it's old anime, you, you know, it's, it, it, it's like, the, you know, Joe, Dragon Ball isn't that great. <laughs> yeah, the bridge, though. Now, th this is my thing, David. I have seen exactly uh, three Tenshi Muyo series. Can't believe there's even more than that, either. Yeah, uh, uh, I think one of them was actually decent. Uh, Not the whole thing, but, like, it was pretty watchable. I am... I don't know. I, I mean, maybe I was too young to fully appreciate it, but it's like the same flip side of things where you're like you're you're you didn't like you're too old to appreciate something. Like, I don't think I'm gonna like Hunter x Hunter, but if I force myself, I'm sure I can get to like it. Whereas like some of the animes you watch, where you're just like, ah, it's just the next one on your list, and you go, I'm gonna look back fondly at watching this one, you know? Yeah. I mean, this is the thing, like, I, well, I don't want to force you to anything, that's why I don't uh, just keep reminding you to watch them, because I know that just won't work. Well, yeah, if you tell someone to do something repeatedly, then they're going to want to do it, that's just basic psychology. Yeah, so I'll just leave you to do it if you really want to, and then we can talk about it, if you, when you do it. God, I'm getting tired just thinking about all the episodes there are. <laughs> I, I think it's pretty bingeable. Especially if you haven't seen it. I don't know. How long until I get to the Chimera person arc? Um. Well. Is it because you want to get there? No, not necessarily, but he looks more interesting. <laughs> well. Just a hundred episodes should be fine. Yeah, that's right. I was, I was thinking it was going to be like that. I mean, it's the last arc of the anime. Is it really? But yeah. Is it, is it that thing where, like, the manga, like, it's past the... You know how, like, animes will go past the manga in some parts? No, no, no. The manga is slightly past the anime. You say slightly. Oh, damn it. No, because bas no, basically what they did is the, um, they finished the, the, this new anime when the manga was in a, a hiatus. And they uh, um, restarted doing things uh, uh, recently. I can't stretch at all in this game. <laughs> but but that's basically what I meant with uh, slightly, David. It basically there was a big hiatus in the middle. I suppose. Um, let's see how many of this. Joe, how many chromatine bars do you have? Uh, three. How many do you need for a pickaxe? I think twelve. Well, my six isn't gonna help. What are you making with it? I'm trying to get a pickaxe. <laughs> oh, okay. Sorry, I heard like my six won't help, and I think I thought you were just making something else. Um, I guess the next best thing I got a gold seven, which can get me some of this stuff, I guess. Hmm. So you have seven gold bars. Uh, I could... Hmm. Wait. Yeah, I got seven. Manga's I ahead don't... now, but they are really inconsistent with the manga releases. Personally, stop reading the manga because they are giving a lot of complex information every manga, but they released it every three months, so it made a mess of everything in my head. Yeah, I've seen a common complaint and with Hunter x Hunter being that things just aren't released fast enough for it. I mean, the thing is, as I said, they, they were in a hiatus. They finally are back, and while they're not very consistent, like very the the chapters are very densely packed. 
which are better being read like as a grouping of them because you will need the information in the um in 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 the other chapters to understand this one hmm. nice to understand it better um yeah i should really continue the elevator Oh. Oh, Bones McGee. Oh, cool. Wait, you've already shopped from him. No, no, that's One-Eyed Willy. That's the same person, is it? Not? It's just the skeleton merchant, yeah? Yes. I mean, they're different people, David. Come on. They all look the same to me. Uh... Whoops. Damn it. Uh... Every chapter has more than 20 pages and like 15 or more pages of characters talking about plans, power, and the more they talk, the more complex things get. It makes things go really slow. I mean, I don't know, Pedro, like, I kind of agree with you that, you know, some some manga really drags on forever. Like, I don't know, it's been Berserk its last chapter, Joe. Yeah. And it just, like, it, it ends on that note, right? Where it's just, you know, it's the fact that he's sad. Uh, yeah, sometimes, yeah, sometimes stories end like that. And I, I appreciate the basis of that. But I feel like it, the ending was brought on because of the whole meme about it. You know what I mean? I mean, yeah. What the hell is hitting me? Oh, this stuff's so hard to see. Hi, David. Hi, I think I'm confused. There you go, that's over. Oh fuck, what's hitting me now? Oh! Oh! That's a shame. Yeah, <laughs> it is. Yeah, I'll, I'll, I'm going to start working on the elevator, so... Oh, we're actually making progress, weirdly enough. The elevator has been a big help, but, uh, I've got some stuff to do. Yeah, Pedro says Berserk's still ongoing. No, uh, I, I think not. They ended it. Yeah, I thought it, it ended with that chapter, but I could be wrong. I mean, unless this is, this is the most elaborate, April, April, like, non-April April Fool's joke. I just kind of find it funny if that, if that is in fact how Berserk ends, like the the story direction really takes a left turn at the last moment, it's funny to me. But as far as like actual enjoyment and like a product goes, I do agree that like for it to have an ending like that, it's fitting. I'm just more disappointed that it would choose to ultimately go that route as opposed to, you know, making it a, the great story of overcoming suffering and everything, you know? I mean, it's just that they don't have the main writer anymore. Yeah, that's true. You might, you might even have something where he tells, like, he's literally in his uh, will or some shit. He told people not to fuck it up. That's fair. I just assumed that, like, manga writers usually have things written out ahead of time. Hell, just regular writers do that. It's called a timeline. Yeah, I, I don't know if he just didn't uh, share, like, all of it, so they decided not to do it, or he simply, um, or, like, he couldn't even be straining with the company, so. That's true. Like, that's the thing, the manga authors do need sometimes to protect themselves from their companies. Pedro is saying it's still ongoing, so I'll, I'll check on that later. 
But I, I'm telling you, Joe, I got to pop off. I have to uh, take care of some work. Okay. It's 11.30, you know. Let me just destroy this, so... Yeah, I was just destroying a tombstone because uh, we made a graveyard down there. Yeah. Not a, we made damn, a not a damn trinket yet for me. Oh, I have a compass for you. No, it's fine. You, you, you have it. No, no, I have a compass already. Oh, you have a second one. Yeah, I found it. It's pronounced a compass, by the way. Oh, compass. Let me give it to you. Coming. Also, let me just put uh, my money on the piggy bank, because I actually have a decent chunk. Okay. Ah, slime. I think... I think the demon I, the crimson, the criminite I used on this yo-yo was well spent. Yeah, it's it's all good. We'll get more of it. The question of is uh, then, do you think that we should uh, how to word this? Should we start bossing, or do you think that we should perhaps still focus on the? How to word this uh, mass collection of things? Okay, I think we first finished the elevator. Um, it's fair, I guess. Yeah, the elevator is only like, a th oh, it's about halfway down, I would say. Yeah, like we finished the elevator. We we probably be finished with it if we stopped goofing off, Joe. I wasn't goofing off, I was getting stuff. Deem the valuable. Uh, l let me see, um... Let me just give you an inventory before you leave. Oh yeah, I was gonna throw by or to you, but if you're gonna do that to me, whatever. No, no, uh... I didn't, uh, like, give you an inventory in the sense I'm going to tell you what I have. Oh. Uh, if you want to throw things to, like, make into bars, go ahead. Okay, Please give me a second to put this dresser down since I saw and decided I had to have it. Aw, <laughs> oh, damn it. I keep falling out through the ground for no reason. This is the weirdest thing. And, and no, I'm not holding down, like, the, the key that makes you go through things. It just happens. I, I understand. Okay. So, um, I have, um, uh, 41, 47 tungsten bars. Oh, uh, okay. More now. Oh, I can still make gold. Where is the gold? There it is. I have uh, 11 gold bars, uh, with what you gave me, uh, 9 criminite bars, I have 99 copper bars, 78 iron bars, and 47 tungsten bars. We should make some chests with iron bars. Okay. How many chests do you want? Just make one and set it over here. And then we can load it up with all the ores. You be against that? No. Uh, um, I was just searching for the the chest. Wrong button. Okay, it's this one. I almost drew ninety nine. Uh, the trash. I'd be upset with you, <laughs> but then again, I, I always why. am. Uh, let me... where is it? Yeah, here it is. One... oh. Oh, damn it. I need to...
This is a fairly frivolous thing you got. Um, I didn't need it, but I wanted it. It's uh, it's to for a glass. Oh, where? Yeah, no, that's a glass kiln. I'm aware. That's why I said it was frivolous. What did it cost? Iron. How much? Eighteen. That's fine. There's you'll seventy-nine have... in there. That's fine. You'll get more. You'll get more. I'm gonna... <laughs> I'll put you working in the mine, boy. It's because we're dwarves. Okay. All right. So until next time, Joe. Until next time.